The Taipei City Department of Labor has hosted its last job fair of the year in Wanghua, providing 1,330 job opportunities. Several companies at the fair were offering monthly salaries ranging from 80,000 to 100,000 NT dollars. For most news reporter Stephanie Yang takes us there for a look at the latest in the job market. <laughs> Job seekers line up to speak to hiring managers. This is a job fair in Wanhua held by the Taipei City Department of Labor. Jobs are available across different sectors, including customer service, sales, and hotel management. I'm here mainly to see what different types of jobs there are. Right now, I'd like to be able to experience various work opportunities to get more life experience. I have five years of experience in the catering industry. I'm mainly looking to become reserve staff for management. I stumbled across an unexpected position here at the fair. It's the position of education specialist. With the loosening of COVID restrictions, the hotel and catering industry are on a hiring spree, opening up 910 job opportunities. The five-star hotel region is offering perks like transportation allowances, cross-hotel transfers, English lessons, and business travel accommodation benefits. A total of 22 companies participated in this employment expo. They're offering 1,000 job opportunities. The opportunities are mainly in the catering and accommodation industry, which was affected by the epidemic. Taipei City Employment Services Office Director Ho Hunsen says there are plenty of job opportunities for foreigners as well. He encourages foreigners to apply for a gold card. Taiwan very much welcomes foreign nationals, especially foreign professionals to come and work in Taiwan. Foreign professionals can apply for Taiwan's employment gold card and they can come to Taiwan to work. Several companies at the expo were recruiting with high salaries. For example, Nanchi Design has 10 positions paid at 100,000 NT a month. Wumo Book is hiring 10 people at 80,300 a month. Unimicron is hiring business engineers offering 70,000 a month. Heidi Lau is hiring foreign language reserve staff at a starting salary of 45,000 NT. We know that the basic salary will be adjusted next year. The companies at the fair have already made adjustments for that. The remuneration provided by them exceeds the basic salary by a lot. This year's fresh graduates happen to enter the job market during the level 3 COVID alert. So we predict that this year's fresh grads will be job hunting for longer than those in the past. We saw the need among young job seekers, and so we held one more job fair. The Taipei City Department of Labor hosted its last job fair of the year in Wanhua, providing 1,330 job opportunities. They hope to help workers get back on their feet and start the new year strong. For Mosa News, Stephanie Yang, Lu Botong in Taipei.